seven signs from the universe you're one of the chosen ones. How to recognize you're one of the chosen ones. Now, when I talk of chosen one, what am I talking about? You see, in ancient times, in ancient Kemet or Egypt, you had babies who were being born and they were different from the rest of the population. And these babies who were being born, they had special gifts and talents, which were so different from everybody else. Growing up, they had to be groomed in the mystery schools to really be reminded of who they were. And they study the sciences, the esoteric wisdom that it's all Maya, it's all an illusion. And we are spiritual beings having a human experience. They were of divine favor and they came here to planet Earth to raise the frequency of the planet. You see, chosen people are not different from regular people. They picked up the call to the universe. Chosen people are people who know the truth when others live in the lie. You've heard the expression, ignorance is bliss. Chosen people embrace the truth. The first sign from the universe, you're one of the chosen ones, is that you came to this planet with your first eye open. And that eye is the third eye. That eye is the all-seeing eye. That eye sees through everything. The BS, the news, the fake stories. The tell eye vision which tells lies to your vision. You can see what most people can't. You have this gift of clairvoyance, which is clear sight clear audience which is clear hearing you can hear frequencies other people can't what's the second sign deep divers from the universe you're one of the chosen ones a normal life is boring normalcy bores you because you realize there is so much more to life than just the nine to five you realize deep divers that most people do their hardest to fit in, and that's a trap. Don't be another brick in the wall, deep divers. And if you realize that, you're one of the chosen ones. It's all about awareness. Deep divers, what is the third sign from the universe? You're one of the chosen ones. You keep having flashbacks to your past life. You realize that this body is gonna fade away, but the spirit is immortal. If you realize you are immortal and you have had many, many, many previous incarnations, if you know that, you are one of the chosen ones. Maktub, the Arabic word for it was written. I realized that I was a priest in ancient Egypt or Kemet. You see, Marcus Aurelius said, whatever we do now echoes on into eternity. And this is what all the sages and ancient masters knew that it's a never ending world. And if you realize, if you can track your past life lineage to an ancient time, you're one of the chosen ones because you are remembering who you really are. What is the fourth sign? The fourth sign from the universe, you're one of the chosen ones. You're starting to question everything. That's right. Growing up, you didn't just blindly accept other people's truth, religion, no, you started to ask questions. You had more questions than answers. When everyone was just following this and following that, you didn't follow anybody. You only followed your own heart. All the answers lie within you. If you realize we are the ones we are waiting for, nobody is coming to save you but yourself. If you realize that, you're one of the chosen ones. We are gods and goddesses. We are made from the same fabric as the universe. We are made of stardust. And if you realize this, you're one of the chosen ones. You have compassion for all life forms on the planet. Being a chosen one is all about when you realize the interconnectedness between everything, that there is no separation. What creates separation is the ego. What is the sixth? 
sign from the universe you're one of the chosen ones. Being free is your birthright. If you don't care about authority, if you realize that it's all a joke, this planet, okay? And you're starting to think for yourself. You're starting to free your mind from this matrix. You're one of the chosen ones. Even if sometimes your family frown at you, you're one of the chosen ones because that's what chosen people have to go through. Hard times. But in that process, through that pressure, you are becoming a diamond. Deep divers, what is the seventh sign? From the universe, you're one of the chosen ones. You realize that time is an illusion. Like in this matrix, they can push the clock forward or back. So how can time be an absolute? Because if we start to realize that time is actually the trap, because once again, we are infinite. If you realize that this 3D reality, which is time-based, is just an illusion, you're one of the chosen ones. If you are moving from fear to love, you are one of the chosen ones. Because in this world, this matrix wants to program you, feed you fear. But if you are aware to that game, you are one of the chosen ones. If you are embracing the love frequency, you are one of the chosen ones. 